What's going on everybody, Martarts Nation here, and today I'm making a new video. Um, it's gonna be pretty much just an update video with some Destiny gameplay. Yes, I got Destiny, uh, some of you guys might hate. I got it for $15 though, great deal. Um, I got it at GameStop. And I will be getting the Taken King, but I don't have any DLC for it right now. So... Pretty much all I'm doing is going to be playing some, uh, some just grind missions, or patrol missions is what they call them. It's pretty much where you go around and do your own missions, pretty, pretty much like free roam, but you get more XP for it. So on to the channel update. I do have Destiny now, and that gives me uh, quite a few games to pick from. Right now I have uh, Assassin's Creed Unity I can play. I can probably make a uh, walkthrough for that since I only played the first mission. I have Star Wars Battlefront, uh, Metal Gear Solid 5, The Phantom Pain, of course Black Ops 3, Destiny, and I have some downloadable games that I downloaded like Ark Survival Evolved and um, some others. So tell me in the comments what you guys want to see. So this is a Destiny... If you're new to it, but you play Black Ops 3, it's pretty much the exact same controls. When I say the exact same, I mean the exact same. Um, Like, if you're sprinting and you press B on Xbox controller, you'll slide. Pretty much your crouch button, you'll slide just like in Black Ops 3. You got your double jump. You have everything. Every single control is the exact same. You, all, you can also earn a what's called a special. You get... You get that from like waiting and then you eventually get it where you can speed up the process by killing. It's called the special and you are, and you activate it by pressing both the uh, bumpers in the back. Just like a special disc in Black Ops 3. It was made by Activision so that would explain these similarities. So I'm going to do this mission. I think I'm going to do like three of them and see how I do. Guardians, attack where the enemy is unprepared. Fight the good fight. Not expected. Stand by for dispatch. All right. So I am only level eight, I think. So I am not that far in the game. So that's probably why I'm liking it so much. It's what some people said to me. But um, I will mainly be playing other games. Just this one, if you guys request it. I really like the gameplay of this so far. I know it's mainly a grind game. But I'm into those kind of RPG games, especially when they're for, when they're first-person shooters in RPGs. This is probably the only game that I've seen that's first-person RPG. I really wish Final Fantasy XIV was on Xbox One, but unfortunately, it's not. Unfortunately, um, Rocket League is coming out this month, February, for Xbox One, and it's going to come bundled with uh, three of the DLC packs. So I am really excited for that. I don't know if it'll be cross-platform or not. I'm really hoping so. But again, Microsoft doesn't really like cross-platform. So what am I doing right now? Oh, I need to find this target. So I just need to follow, see where that uh, marker is. That's where I need to go. I don't really need my uh, ship thing anymore. Alright, pull out this thing right here. So yeah, tell me in the comments what you guys want me to see. Um, I've been having trouble getting this video out. I've just had a lot of trouble with the video in general. If I can... Oh, I was stuck on the wall. <laughs> so, this game plays almost exactly like Black Ops 3. Just with a lot more RPG elements to it. And the best part is you can... Oh, sorry, it's getting a little loud here. The best part is you can play with friends. So, if you have friends who have it, you can play with up to six friends on a fire team. 
A fire team is basically like a mini party thing. But you can have, I think, up to like 12 people. 12 of your friends on the map at the same time. They just won't be in your party. But you can still play with them. And if you get them all into Xbox chat, then you'll be set. So I got a new weapon. Okay. Yeah. I'm really liking the game so far. If you want to play with me for any of my games, uh, feel free to add me on Xbox. My gamer tag is Martarts Gaming. I'm probably going to change it to Martarts Nation. Uh, I can't change it to Martarts because I was stupid. I made a separate account with the name Martarts. With the gamer tag Martarts, and I deleted that account. But apparently, even if you delete it, the username's gone forever. So, that username is unavailable for me. So, I'm probably going to change it to Nation. If not, I'll let you guys know what it is. But right now, it's Martarts Gaming. Feel free to add me and see how I got my supercharged. So, I press both buttons and it'll activate. Oh, that brings up a good point. Um, if you are a big Call of Duty fan and have been watching Allie's Black Ops 3 videos, he calls his, um, his, the specialist Seraph has the, uh, uh, weapon, the Annihilator. He calls that the Golden Gun. Um, he got that reference from Destiny because, let me show you real quick. Because the super that I'm using right now is called the Golden Gun. Literally, it's called the Golden Gun. Golden Gun. Summon a flaming pistol which disintegrates enemies with solar light. It's the exact same. So that's where he got the reference from. Any of you Destiny fans probably already know that. So that's why he calls it the Golden Gun. Oh, I missed. Hmm, got him. So yeah, you can do whatever you want on this game. It's a huge map, so... You won't run out of things to do. Summon our vehicle. This reminds me of the speeder was from uh, Star Wars Battlefront 3. They ride exactly like it. Like, you have a boost and everything. They can't shoot, though. You can steal some that do shoot. And before I die. So you can see my health meters at the top. Can't wall run, but, I mean, they had to have some unique things for Black Ops 3. I really like the sniper. I, there's three classes you can pick from, and you can have three different heroes, so you can have all three classes. Um, there's the hunter, which I'm using right now. Oh. Basically, the hunter is just a, uh, a sniping class. There is the titan, which is the all-around infantry. And you can have the warlock, which uses magic. But you have three uh, character slots, so you can really use them all. I like hunter. I don't know why. It just... I just like it. That's what I'm using right now. If you guys want a tutorial on how to play or anything for any of my games, feel free to ask. What is this? Did I really miss? There we go. I don't know what this is. Alright, I'm just gonna go. Keep pressing that button. Back to Okay. So, I'll probably be using my super really soon this type of mission uh i'll be attacking a certain target where do i go um oh i didn't even see there's a way through okay oh I meant to throw my grenade not my knife I grabbed that ammo. Yeah, it has a lot of RPG elements. There's a lot of guns you can make. 
you can upgrade guns, upgrade abilities. Okay, that's my target. So I'm going to use my golden gun. As you can see, look at this thing. Does this not mind you of the Seraph? It makes them explode. Just like in Black Ops 3. And there's the mission. So that's basically one of the patrol missions, or small quick missions that just help you gain XP. Alright. So I do have a Metal Gear Solid 5 video I made of oh, just me having fun stealthing a uh, mission 100% stealth without using snipers and that's a lot of stuff I'm not doing anything to that I don't know what that is I'm gonna leave <laughs> that thing is huge though I'm doing no damage to it Oh, I thought that was the guy. I guess I'll help this guy kill him. I'm only level 7, so I won't be doing... Alright. Got some equipment. So yeah, there can be a lot of people on the map at once. Alright. These green things are your mission, uh... Are your mission things. That's where you get your new missions. Your new patrols, I see. Patrols, not missions. Because they're not really full-on missions. I thought I got a headshot on that. Alright, level up. And I got my super again. I usually don't get it this often. Okay. Ooh, I can upgrade. As you can see, this is your uh, main character screen. This is what I look like. Uh, you can upgrade armor. 35, 42. Yeah, my armor is way better than that. I can upgrade my sniper. Okay. Um, Long range scope. All right, and I can also upgrade my guy right here. All right, new mission. Be on the lookout for enemy command in your vicinity. Server connection. I think that changed my uh, scope. Yeah, you can change your weapons out mid in game. So like if I wanted to use like a scout rifle, okay, I was using an auto rifle. It's basically a machine gun. Scout rifles are like uh, semi-automatic. They are semi-automatic guns. I'm going to grab this and and gram right here. So, this one one hits to the head. You can also get pulse rifles, which you charge up and then shoot. I, those are probably my least favorite. I'll show you all the weapon types right here. You got a pulse rifle. You got auto rifle. You have hand cannon. They're basically just really good pistols. Scout rifle. It's like a sniper semi-automatic. And I thought there was one more. Okay, uh, for your secondaries, you have sniper rifles. Um, fusion rifles, shotguns, that's all I've gotten to unlock. And then you got heavy weapons, which are like rocket launchers. 
and machine guns. I really like uh, these right here. I'm just, I just want to use my... Uh, there we go. I just wanted to use it for no real reason. All right, so let's see, it's all the way over there. You can see these things do a lot of damage. They're like mini shotguns, mini shotgun primaries. I'm surprised this is actually a primary weapon. What that guy was doing? Seems like it'd be more of a secondary weapon, and like uh, fusion rifles would be a primary. Also, shotgun could be a good primary, too. But a pistol? I mean, they do a lot of damage. They're more accurate than shotguns and do about the same amount of damage, so... I like them, just because they're fun to use. They're easy to use, too. You don't need to be aiming a lot. Whoa. I got an upgrade for this already. Okay. Look at the uh, sights on this. This looks just like the Annihilator. Like it has those floating uh, reticle sight. Looks really cool. I got my upgraded sniper. Shows how much ammo I got. Headshots do way more damage, so if you're using a sniper, go for headshots. Because a level 1 sniper, like, the first sniper you get, which you get right when you start the game, like, before you go anywhere, you get a primary and a secondary. It still can one-hit these guys. Um, if you hit headshots. If you don't hit headshots, you can't. This thing is strong. can barely hit it too. There we go. Alright, got the target destroyed and that's mission complete. I'm gonna just get out of here. I don't really need to fight these guys. I don't need to level up that much. Alright, I'm gonna stay right here. You get upgrades fairly quickly as you see. Let's see. Causing damage, increased stability. Just got some extra upgrades. Same with my, wait, I can upgrade my sniper again. Increased attack power. All right. Forty-four attack. That's pretty good for level nine. I think I might have something. This is way stronger, but. I have to be level 11 to use it. So I can't. It's pretty much useless. Yeah, it's, this is the best weapon I got for secondaries. Like, I got this cool, uh, cool tracking rocket launcher I'll show you. Oh, yeah. You gotta hold the uh, weapon switch, and I don't have ammo for it. Alright, well, I think I'm gonna end the video pretty soon. I just wanted to make a uh, update video that had some information that you might like and some gameplay of the new game i got again i will be getting the taken king at a later date R not right now but okay this thing that that might have been a headshot i want to see how much damage it does without being a headshot though there's someone up there someone right here okay no headshot 316 that might just be because that was the max. Alright, well, I think I'm going to end the video here. Um, Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, make sure to hit the like button. If you're new, make sure to subscribe. And as always, comment. Because I want to know what games to play. I'm going to get some user feedback. Share the video if you feel obligated to. And make sure you check out my Twitch. It will be in the description. I stream all my videos almost all of them so make sure to check them out this will be it um i guess i'll see you guys next time